It's a plastic bottle. An empty water bottle. It's a water bottle. Um, a, uh, a empty <laughs> water bottle. This isn't empty anything. This is something full of potential. I guess this is a, re it's a renewable resource. Nature has a biological metabolism where one thing's waste becomes another thing's food. So if I look at something like a plastic bottle, I don't see waste. I see a nutrient. This is raw material? So if this is raw material, people need to start thinking about it that way. It could come back as a bottle, of course. We only have to make this virgin material one time, and the rest of it's up to you. We get the bottle back, we'll make this bottle out of, out of recycled content again. We see everything from clothing to carpets, toys, at Shaw Industries. They take billions of bottles like this, polyester, and they turn it into fibers, into essentially textiles, and by spinning it into threads. And then they use those fibers to weave and tuft carpet. And those can then be, again, recycled. These processes mean we can develop systems to collect all this material because it's valuable. Plastics can be put into continuous reuse. I'm gonna spend a lot of my time in the next couple of years helping to create a system where there's a lot of recycled content material available for people like our company and others to get this material back and use it again. This is worth something. So now, I guess I see a lot of possibilities in this bottle. I really love the idea of endless reuse. Today, it's a bottle. Tomorrow, it can be something else.